for Mike first. Who's ready? Derek, and then Scott. KJ, you guys really handled that challenge tonight. What was your focus, and how did you feel about the way you performed? Yeah, so definitely the focus was defense. Uh, execute on defense, share the ball, and play the right the right way. So I think we did a great job uh, doing this, and and we are where we are. I guess for both of you, what do you take away from a win like this? Where I mean, you were kind of in the, the driver's seat pretty early. I mean, we still have to be uh, in the game, play all 40 minutes because anything can come back from uh, any any point different. So we just keep going. Yeah, I feel like it was important to you know build team chemistry. You know, throughout the whole game, we executed well on defense throughout the whole game. We were hustling all game, and it's it's important to keep your head up in those games and just keep fighting. Question for you, Will. Uh, so the, you guys uh, came out just intense from the start. I just want to know what the mindset was, you know, coming into the matchup. Um, you know, just do our thing. Uh, play hard defensively. Uh, crash the glass. Uh, you know, just execute on offense and you know make plays for others. KJ, coming from Europe and having to play, play maybe a more, it's a little bit more physical here. What's been the biggest adjustment for you? Um, as far as like to that kind of like you're better getting through screens, things like that. What's been the adjustment for you? Yeah, like I said, everywhere that basketball is basketball, uh, is the same game. So, yeah, the physicality maybe uh, is bigger, but I played also with men in Europe, so the physicality was even even better there. So, I'm just trying to to improve every day, and that's it. Okay, a similar question, Brad. Talked about you making strides on defense. I guess what have what are the steps you've made to take to the next level, not on offense but on defense? I mean, that's what. Where we focus every practice is defense and getting through screens and contesting shots. So that comes daily with daily work. You guys are getting another crack at an SEC team. You're taking on Arkansas during Thanksgiving. How's it going? And I'm at. Uh, what? Just you guys are taking on. And you're getting another crack at an SEC team, Arkansas. What lessons did you guys learn um, with Alabama just on Wednesday? Um, I feel like uh, we, we learned a lot from Alabama. Like they're a great team. Uh, they play very fast, and I feel like Arkansas is pretty similar in that way. But we're just prepping for them, getting ready as a team, and you know, doing our best. Yeah, we know it's a tough opponent. They're a very good team, and we have to execute even better. Uh, we will watch uh, film and do our game plan later this week, and uh, we will try our best. KJ, we saw you get your first tech. The bench seemed to be kind of proud of you for it. Uh, what went into that? Yeah, they were proud of me. The coaches were proud of me too. So, I know I, it will not happen again. But, uh, but yeah, that was that was to hype the team up. I've never seen them get that high before. <laughs> well, Brett has compared you to Michael Beasley a lot. I guess do you have an NBA player that you build your game off of? Um. You know, I, I watch a lot of guys like highlights and clips, but I wouldn't say uh, there's a specific player that I compare my game off, but I like that comparison for sure. A question for either of you. I just wanted to know, how do you guys build your rounding into your identity uh, as a team right now? Uh, I feel like we're doing great right now. We're, we're, we're right where we want to be right now. Uh, we're uh, competing at a very high level, doing all the right things right now, but we can only get better from here. We're a very young team, so you know, this isn't our peak for sure. We can get a lot better. Yeah, we just have to practice every day hard, uh, as hard as we can, and and try to reach our best. Yeah, it's for both of you. This team has a lot of guys that can make plays for other people. Just what does that maybe give you offensively? Where uh, whether it's UKJ or Will or Kylan, you know, Tommy. I mean, just that you can kind of anybody can you know, run an offense like that. Yeah, that helps for sure because everyone can do everything in our team, and there's not. Everyone knows their role, but everyone can do everyone's role also. So uh, I think we're doing a great job in offense, and uh, we'll com continue working on that and improving. For, for both of you, obviously freshmen are playing a huge role on, on this team, yeah, a team full of newcomers. So do you think in those terms about taking pride in the freshman class and are, are you a tight-knit group you know, as, a, as a group? Um, I just feel like, you know, as a freshman, it doesn't really matter if you're really a freshman or not. Like, if you're good enough, you're going to play. He's going to play you. Uh, that's the thing I love about coach. Like, if, if you're good enough, he's going to play you no matter what. And yeah, I think that's great. Yeah, 
we yeah. all agree there's no like age difference because we all here, we all players, and we compete against other players. Doesn't matter what age they are. I, I know Thomas isn't here, but you know he's playing his brother on Thanksgiving against Arkansas. Has he talked about it? Is he excited to take on his brother? Has he mentioned anything? I mean, yeah, of course. Uh, I couldn't imagine playing with my brother. It's, it would just be, it would be, it would be great. It's definitely going to be, you know, very fun to, you know, for him, you know, uh, talking to his family about it. It's probably, it's probably very hype. Yeah, I can't wait to see to see them playing each other. Will said. You haven't seen KJ that hype. If he, he talking trash to you in, in practice or anything like that, he seemed like somebody that has some toughness to him, though, no doubt. Nah, he, he is a very tough guy for sure, but he, he's a very nice guy as well, so nah, he, doesn't, he doesn't talk too much trash, but you know, he's a tough guy for sure. KJ, this team turned Arkansas over 19 times. I think you guys only had like eight turnovers in this game. Is it, has that been a point of emphasis for you? taking care of the ball, being a little more uh, sound with the basketball. Yeah, for sure, to be more sharp with the ball uh, and just handle the pressure that the defense gives. So I think today we did a good job of this. Well, it seems like Trey's been giving you guys good activity here recently. What are you seeing from him and what he's bringing to you guys? Uh, Trey's great, man. Uh, he's always going to crash the glass. He's a great teammate. Uh, he's going to uplift us, you know. I see him as like, you know, he, he's like a very good mentor to me. You know, he's older, he's been through the rough. Um, you know, he's just been teaching me a lot about offensive rebounding. He's great at it. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Guys. Thanks.